If you see these men, contact law enforcement. Hours after the FBI released the Tsarnaev brothers' photos, just before 10.30 Thursday night, two men round the corner and approached MIT police officer Sean Collier as he sits in his cruiser. Bright lights flash. Calls come into MIT dispatch. It sounds like somebody's hitting a trash can really loud, or there's the cruiser that's right by there. Okay, we'll, we'll check it out. In that cruiser, Officer Collier shot multiple times is not responding either to radio or cell calls. A sergeant arrives. Collier has a slight pulse but is bleeding badly. Other police now on scene frantically perform CPR trying to save him. His gun belt is removed blood visible on the gun handle. Prosecutors say Jahar and Tamerlan Sarnaev tried to steal the firearm which was triple locked in its holster. An MIT student rides by in a bike. He testified seeing a young guy leaning into the cruiser. Quote, he snapped up and turned around. He looked startled. I made eye contact. He had a big nose. He was wearing a dark sweatshirt and hat. Asked whether that man was in court, the student pointed, identifying Jahar Tsarnaev. Tsarnaev, flanked by his lawyers, watched video described as him and his brother running from the murder scene. Earlier in the day, the jury, along with Tsarnaev, were shown bomb components, including a twisted 8-inch piece of a pressure cooker, BBs and nails used as shrapnel, 